Hello guys and welcome back to the Teacher Made channel where everything is made by a teacher. Today we will be looking at one of my favorite websites that I like to use inside my classroom and this website is called Hit the Button. A lot of teachers don't know about this website but it is a great website to use for children ages in grades three and up. Um, we use it at my school, especially in the fifth grade, where we have challenges, where we have the kids challenge one classroom to another on their times tables, and I can show you guys. So if you just go to the website, you just put in hit the button, um, dot com. You can click on any one of these buttons down below. You have number bonds, doubles, halves times tables, division facts, and square numbers. But first we're gonna look at the times tables because this is what we use inside my classroom and my school. So when you click on the time tables button, you have mixed numbers where, where you can just challenge your students and they'll have mixed numbers. That means they'll just have multiplication problems or from different sets of multiples, like twos, threes, all the way up until 12. Or you can have tables up to 10. And on this one, you can also have mix. You can have hit the answer, and I'll show you guys in a minute the example what the screen will look like. So you can do it by hit the question, or you can do it by hit the answer. So like twos, let's do twos. So then this screen is gonna come up and it says you will be shown a calculation, hit the button that shows the correct answer. And down here you have a timer. So this works on their math fluency. So they'll be able to do the most multiplication problem within a certain amount of time. And it also keeps their score down at the bottom too. So let's go ahead and try it. Four times two is eight. Nine times two is 18. So as you can see down at the bottom, it is keeping my time and it's also keeping my score as well. So like I said, this works on math fluency and this is why I like hit the button because this also works for my students with disabilities. And if they were to get the wrong answer, so like on, we know six times two is 12, but I just wanna click the wrong answer so you will see what happens. So it'll be red, it'll light up red. And then once they click the right answer, it'll turn green back again. So you'll just do this until the time runs out. So as you can see down at the bottom, the timer is running out of time. So you wanna see how many your students can get within the amount of time. So that was time's up. And I scored an 18 out of 19 because as you can see, I had got that problem wrong, but I wanted to show you guys what will happen if one of your students were to get one of the questions wrong. And this is why I like using hit the button inside my classroom, because like I said, you can do hit the answer or let's try or hit the question, let's do mix. So this is what it looks like when it's mixed. So they'll have different multiples and on this one is hit the answer so you got to try and figure out which two numbers multiplied together will give you 64. So you'll do the same thing on this one um, and the students can try it out like I said if they get it wrong then it'll, like I said it'll light up red until they get the correct answer and this is really good for working in groups among your classroom, you can put them in four on teams, or you can also have them, we did it working one fifth grade classroom against another fifth grade classroom. And I liked it because it gave my students, you know, a chance to realize, you know, how good they are at numbers and just how good they are at numbers and just working together as a group and then having them do math fluency, math fluency facts and just on different ways that you can learn. And I'm gonna show you guys the doubles 
Um, so these are the doubles. You can go up to 10, 5 to 15, 10 to 20. I tend to use this with my lower grades, any child who's under the second grade. So for my second graders, I use this for them. You know, they're just adding up the double. Two times two, we know is four. Six plus six is 12. So this is the doubles. And it's the same thing. It's the timer at the bottom where they have to try and guess and get the answers right before the timer runs out. So those were doubles. And let's look at the division. Division is the same thing as a multiplication. I'm just gonna show you guys real quick. So it's the same thing as the multiplication. Um, we're gonna go back to number bonds. So the number bonds, you do up to 10, up to 20, up to 100, or you can even do decimals. And like I said, I mostly use hit the button for like my older students, but it can be used for all ages. And like I said, a lot of teachers don't know about this website, but this is a great website. And it's also available at the App Store, Google Play. Um, it's good on Windows and Mac. So like I said, this is an interactive game with fire questions on number bonds, timetables. And like they said at the bottom, it's great for ages six to 11. So that's about kindergarten through fifth grade. And this is why I love using hit the button. And thank you again for watching the Teacher Made channel where everything is made by a teacher.